India is home to over 6% of global marine diversity. Over a 7517 km coastline, Indian oceans have been protecting us for millennia. Now, it's time for us to protect our oceans. Let's start conversations, strive for innovations and vote for protection of Indian Ocean region. Introducing Marine Time Research Center, Foundation for Underwater Domain Awareness. The concept of the Maritime Research Center I thought of as a technology driven think tank because I feel there is a gap in terms of strategy not being backed by sound technology and particularly when we talk about the Indian Ocean region there is uh, significant <coughs> differences in our understanding of the underwater domain and uh, the tropical littoral waters have their very specific challenges which need to be addressed and that's how I thought of this uh, organization where we are going to be talking uh, work, working on the policy technology and innovation and the human resource development because going forward when we look at the underwater domain awareness framework it's going to be a huge opening and there is tremendous opportunity that are come going to come but to have a coherent and a comprehensive way forward all the three aspects are important and that's how we are uh, looking at all these things MRC is driven with a three pronged mission to engage with decision makers and policy formulators to facilitate technology and innovation to spread awareness and start conversations on underwater domain awareness the underwater domain awareness framework is a concept that touches all the four stakeholders when we look at the underwater domain there are security requirements whether it is internal security or external security then there is the blue economic requirement there's tremendous opportunities uh, in terms of shipping undersea resources a whole lot of other things the third is the environment and the disaster management that also requires tremendous technologies and also proper policies where they can be addressed effectively and the fourth is pure science and technology we all know science and technology will be the driver for all things to come but specifically having science and technology tailored for the requirement is very very important and that's how mrc tries to address the uda framework in a very very comprehensive manner MRC wants to be a nodal agency dealing with the UDA framework. We want to look at all aspects of policy. We want to look at all aspects of technology and innovation and we also want to be a nodal agency for the human resource multidisciplinary human resource development. Here when we look at human resource we are like looking at two distinct communities if I may use the word. One is people who are already in the domain, people who are part of the stakeholders. they have a reasonably good understanding of the domain but they need to be given the right academic backing and the theoretical understanding to, or the research background so that they can contribute so maybe you know stakeholders can go into the policy level with a uh, sound understanding of the uh, domain also we need younger people to come in I mean we have uh, say a computer science uh, student how he can apply his computer science understanding into the underwater domain awareness or an electronic student how he can apply his understanding in the underwater domain awareness or even a law student uh, or a history student how they can bring value or a mass communication student how they can bring value so we are looking at a multidisciplinary approach and also distinctly kind of uh, make it clear that what they can contribute and how they can build a future career in this domain